Hey guys, AJRM6200 here, and welcome to part 4 of my Sonic Forces playthrough. Last time we've completed Prison Hall, finished the Zavok, or Zavok boss fight, and Egg Gate. And now here we, on, here we are going to the first tag team stage of Sonic Forces called Arsenal Pyramid. Which, by the way, yes, I had to correct myself by saying Zavok, because... My whole life, or at least since 2013, um, I always said his name as if it was Zavik, because, you know, like, Havoc and whatnot, and by the way, stop here, because if you go back, there's a red ring, but yeah, I always, uh, pronounce it as Zavik, because, you know, Havoc and whatnot, but I guess it's pronounced Zavok, and you see, I would have known that if they mentioned his Zavok's name in, uh, Lost World at least once. <laughs> like text and trailers isn't gonna help. I I need to hear it pronounced. And apparently, uh, he Zavok was in uh, Mario and Sonic at the Rio 2016 Olympics Games. But I never played that game, and so I never kn knew that that's how you pronounce his name. Because wait, all right, good, got the red ring there. And, oh, you know what? This would have been the perfect stage to have the lightning wisp because of this. You could just like light speed dash through the entire stage and just give no craps at all. Oh well, we still got the burst wisp which we can use to our advantage. So let's go ahead and use that. But yeah, they say his name in uh in Mario and Sonic at the uh, Rio 2016 Olympic Games. But since I never played that, I never knew. So. It only took me until this game to find out that it's actually pronounced Zavok. So, and uh, I screwed up. And died. Well, that's the first that's the first death of this playthrough. Let's try this again. Well, at least we get to see this part. This part is basically like combat. It's pretty simple if you have the burst wisp, just spray your flamethrower around. Shouldn't be too hard. So be cautious if you're playing this part with the uh, lightning wisp because you're gonna be going all over the place. Anyway, no, don't go up yet because there's a red ring right next to the spring and it's funny because when I was collecting all the uh, red rings in my main account, I was always wondering where is the last red metal? And it only took me a while to notice that it was right there, and I was like, "Are you? Are you? How did I not know? Like, it's hard to notice when you're going so fast, but just remember that that's that's the final red ring's right there. So, anyway, we got the S rank. I think that's I think that's uh, thanks to the daily mission bonus. So, once again, make sure you complete those daily missions. Mission complete. Clear stage 7. What did we get? Ooh. Ooh. Crocs! Yes! We <laughs> and we got the Splatoon bodysuit. Let's go, man. I already know what I'm... And by the way, we got the Lightning Wisp on again. Even though we already got in the previous episode, we can get Wisp Bonds of the... Uh... We can get the same Wisp on as last time, except the next one will have, like little upgrades to it so it has like little ring bonuses as you can see right there anyway we got this belt some shoes this thing in any way let's continue onward something is attacking inside the mystic jungle silver is fighting him or it or whatever just hurry guys it's him I'm looking forward to a second round with this guy. Alright, so the next stage is Luminous Forest in Mystic Jungle, but hold on as I, uh, make some adjustments to my custom character. Wait, oh, uh, oh uh, yeah, Wisp on changing. Um, we could use the regular, but are you kidding me? We're going with the upgraded one. So, we're gonna use the Lightning Wisp from now on until we get new ones. But let's head on to the, the fitting room and change some stuff. So we got a little crown here. We got we got a little bandana. A beanie. But we're gonna keep the Poyo Poyo hat. 
We're gonna wait. Actually, do I want these or do I want to keep these? Huh? I want these. I want these. Um, we're not gonna choose a uh, mask. Or actually, the surgeon mask. Yes. Um. Now we're gonna uh, we're gonna stick with the uh, the human like hands, and we're gonna boy we're gonna give my character some Crocs. Yes, <laughs> we're giving him some Crocs. All right, sorry about that. Quick edit right there. So uh, where were we? Ah, uh, yes, changing the bodysuit. We're gonna give him the Splatoon treatment. And actually, let's take off the eye eye outfit. Wait. Yeah, we're gonna take off the eye eye outfit so we can see the full Splatoon right here. And we're gonna give him a backpack. Let's give him this. He already looks beautiful. Look at that. And he looks even better in his in his nice leather yellow leather Crocs. <laughs> so uh, anyway, we got that done. Let's continue on to the next stage. Luminous Forest. Anyway, uh, this is Luminous Forest. This is one of the stages in forces that are pretty much the definition of boost to win. Just hold the square button and go. This is, this is the beginning of the stage right here. And it's literally just like a straight path of boosting. Um, but there are there is platforming to be found, at least in the uh, 2D sections. Here I'm just booking out and care about red rings right now. But hey, you can get the uh, third red ring if you uh, go up to the upper pathway and get to the top of that with the loop. So yeah, keep that in mind. The, uh, the two red rings you can find at the bottom pathway, so make sure to grab those as well. And also, stop here because you got a homing attack to this uh, path of buzz bombers, so that way you can wait. That way you can get yourself the fourth red medal. Yeah, the first and second one, they're on the bottom pathway at the beginning. Um, you're gonna have to play the stage twice so you can get that, uh, red ring that we just passed by. And the, uh, the red rings in the, in the beginning. Actually, I think you can backtrack, but I don't know. Anyway, giant snake. Can I straight out perfect this? Come on. Come on. Dang it! I want to get a straight out perfect. Got screwed over by that one great. Oh well. We have finished the stage. And we got an S rank. What did we get for our avatar? We got the gamer hat. To let people know that I'm a gamer. That we're gamers. Clear stage 8 within 100 seconds. What else? Did we? we got an upgraded burst with spawn. We got this coat. Some more shoes. More paint splatter. I'm gonna have to check that out, actually. Clear stage 8 with an S rank. We got a Chow backpack. Man, we need to see the Chow garden again. A Viking helmet. Some hard eye glasses. Gloves. Some boots. And that bodysuit. And now, let's continue onward. No oh, cutscene, really? Huh, all right. Well, I'm gonna save this uh, boss fight for the next part. So, right now I'm actually gonna go customize the avatar, see what I can do. Nah, we're gonna stick with these. Nothing for gloves. We're keeping the Crocs. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Crocs are life. We're gonna give him the Chow backpack. Yeah, we need to find the see the Chow garden again. 
Let's check out this Splatoon bodysuit. Hmm, what do I like better? I kind of like this better. Yeah, we're gonna stick with this one. But, uh... Wait, alright. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please remember to leave a like and a comment. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more content. Twitter and Google Plus will be in the description below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao.